Hello there, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome back to Motherland Ursus, where we're gonna continue going through chapter 13 today. Uh, and I don't have to, and I don't have a lot of time today, so let's just start. I I was able to to farm the materials for Overdon, so he's here today. Lukuma, hello, Dr. Reina. But I gotta, gotta farm the materials for his second skill now. I wasn't able to start them three on S2. On S1. Uh, so sure, we can bring him today. Why not? Hey, oh. Hi there, Irina G GNC. Uh, so yeah, we are on stage 12 now. This one. One thing I want to do here, I want to, I want to use rope, maybe shawl. Maya, okay, I'll call you Maya. I want to use Jay here to kill the snipers. And then we just need the basic defense at the bottom. It's probably gonna look something like this uh, we need the caster mm. and we just bring uh, our vanguards get crystals out of outer range and the stages is enough let me see I can bring a target to kill a defender early if I want to and what else? I don't know. Bring Humus as well. Or... Eat them. There you go. Let's go like this. Seems like forcing episode 13 is easier than episode 12, right, Kuma? Mm, I can't say that yet, because I'm only halfway through the chapter 13. Yo, where are we at? Halfway through, this is stage 12. Yesterday I stopped at 11. I just want to get to 15 today, at least. But I don't have a lot of time today. And I started late. <laughs> so, I, ho I hope I can do it. I have to get there, because I need to start Verdant Test 2. Tomorrow. Here's a cool thing though. Uh, wait. Hmm, yeah. Shaw goes there. I want to use Shaw and Rope here to get rid of some of these lugs. Then we don't need to worry about all of them. Come on. But yeah. As long as they stay here, they, they won't respawn. As GNC told me. And we just sit up here. Like this. And we're good to go. Yeah, Rope doesn't get all of them. That's okay. I'll wait for one more mortal skill. You started around this time yesterday. That works true. Mm, it's almost one hour less, but sure. It's just four stages, right? But I should be okay. I need to get at least to 15 today. Okay. You the defender, Indigo. You the defender. Come on. Okay. Uh, the snipers are not a problem. As long as Jay doesn't block these lugs when there's a lot of them. Oh, but look, Shao is even putting these lugs in the hole. That's nice. 
Their tier 13 has a new enemy, but there are no altars, so shouldn't be too difficult. We'll see. It's, it also depends if my skill issue will decide to, to jump up on me or not. Let me just focus for a second here, because stuff is happening right now. The Tag took half HP of one of the crystals. Tag is strong. Okay. I don't know. Deploy Verdant here. <laughs> I don't think Verdant is gonna do anything, but deploy him. Look at him. Kill yourself. Okay, and this stage is over. We just need to kill the crystals now. <laughs> well, the chapter has some of the most notable power creep to normal enemies in a while. Which is a good thing. We can't always just go up in HP numbers. Uh, the new enemy gets stronger when a operator enemy dies around it. Damn, Kuma. I thought it would promote self-love for Verdant. <laughs> what? <laughs> Look. It's okay to say that an operator will do nothing in a specific situation, okay? For example, if I wanted Verton to die and stay alive, that's something that he could do, because he has his clone. <laughs> but in there, it's not like he would deal damage to the to the crystals. This is a throwback to chapter one. Or to Cargo Escort, the LMD stages. <laughs> you told Verton to kill himself. That's literally what that class does. <laughs> okay. Two elites. Mm. You told me there's a new enemy, and I don't know, they might throw stun enemies at me. Uh, they should be okay, it's a three lane stage. Mm. Well. Don't have time to think. Let's just jump in. Let's die on and see the enemies. It's fine. It's enrichment for Verdant. <laughs> How do you do? Hi, Silver Gun. Uh, I woke up late. I have stuff to do, so I don't have a lot of time. Uh, I'm just praying that I don't get stuck in the next three stages. Because I need to get to 15 today. Other than that, I'm good. I'm great. Never better. Professional... Our master who protects the Feramilt Skeleton. When, sum <coughs> when summoning friendly or enemy units are defeated, when surrounding, recover a certain amount of HP and gains increase the attack. When defeated, leaves behind two blood amber. This is... Our new 4 star defender, but better. <laughs> Oh boy. 15 is where you get stuck. Darn it. Don't tell me that, Superga. Now I have no hope of finishing what I need to. I guess it's okay. Even if I get stuck, I can play 15 on normal off stream and then I can start Verdant second skill. I guess that works. What are the stats on this thing? Let's see. Yeah, he takes absolutely no damage from it, and so he has... He has... Uh, at least 1300 defense, I would imagine. Maybe I'm wrong. But that's the... that's what it's... Give me impressions. Mm, what about you, Tag? Okay, he doesn't have much harass. And he doesn't have much HP as well, he just has high defense. Okay, that's fine. I don't mind that. 
He's recovering his HP. No, 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 that, that I noticed. But I, I'm just checking the damage that he's been dealt. You can you can notice how many how many pixels of HP he loses. So like Ethan here is dealing minimum damage with 1360 attack. So I can only imagine that he has 1300 de defense. Yeah, probably. Don't know for sure though. Let's see. He doesn't heal when he kills Verdant. <laughs> okay. Hmm. Is this it? Yeah, I think this is the stage. Okay. So what do I need here? I need three guards. I need more arts damage. It looks like the sides are safe. Which is weird. Why would they make a, a map like this and leave the sides safe? That That's so unlike Arcanites these days. Yeah. <clears throat> mm, I guess we can do some Utagi. This is a tutorial stage, bro. Even then, this is not common anymore. Arknight just kills you these days. Like, understand that I entered this blind and I'm clearing it. I wonder if I will be able to kill this last guy, but even then, this is not normal, okay? Just here to teach you how to deal with a stealth guy. <laughs> oh, that was way too much damage. Okay. Oh. <laughs> yeah. Oh, stop killing my ops. <laughs> Darn it. Hmm. Deploy Verdant on him. Beep, <laughs> you got one shot. Uh, Jay won't have attack. Oh, and now he's outside Arts range. Mm. Yeah, it's time. Let me go again. Uh, just clear 1321 on normal. Good luck for stars. Good day for everyone in chat. <laughs> Why people have no faith? <laughs> I don't get it. I feel like every other stream I get someone saying this is impossible with four stars. No matter what I'm doing. <laughs> okay, let me change this. Going to be honest, did this in adverse like a few hours ago. Did not know that the guy got attacks attacks. What? He gets attack up? That's why I started dying so hard. Uh... Oh yeah, that's true. Gets attack up. Not saying it's impossible, just wish it's like, okay, thank you. <laughs> thank you and I'm sorry. Okay, so I'll leave Verdant in the squad because yes. Uh, I guess I don't want Ethan in there then, but I will bring more casters. Hmm. And then I can bring... Oh, since the guy got some damage on him, I guess I can bring my defenders. I'll have the casters to do damage. And then I can... Just bring a couple medics. One medic. One medic is fine. Let's go. Now it works. Not sure if rope is useful here. I feel splash caster instead. I just entered there with whatever I had in my squad just to see what enemies lied ahead. I had absolutely no expectations to win the stage. 
That's why I was so so weird that I almost did it. Cause that's that's not okay. That's not normal for Arcanite these days. I feel like. Okay, so I guess I want Bubble to get his aggro. Just because Bubble is Bubble is better at being hit. Hello, I hit you go. Okay. <clears throat> oh wait, he threw my clever rope. I didn't see that lock. <laughs> Even then. Damn. This guy caves to arcs. Oh, and he doesn't deal damage at all if you don't give him stacks. Okay. Now, just to play more casters. Uh, sure. This works. In my honest opinion, the Seager is pretty good on this stage. I used Hosa, but maybe Totter would be useful as well. Ah, don't worry, we're gonna clear it this time. <sighs> besiegers are always good. There's literally no situation where, where a besieger would be bad. Because even if you're killing just a bunch of trash mobs, why not use a besieger? <laughs> True. For dealing with middle lane. Nah, don't worry about it. Look, we activate bubble and he doesn't do damage anymore. Mm, let me see. I don't need this two anymore. Pine! Oh. <laughs> that was a little bit too close. Okay, next one. GG. Okay, I have two hours to beat two stages. Let's go. I dropped it too salty, that's nice. Maybe it's the game telling me it's time to get salty. Ooh, medal. I didn't check the new medals. Let me let me see that. Um uh, where here at the least it's in progression meadow episode meadow there you go what are the new medals 1221 in any environment huh they're giving the medal even if for you to, to clear on easy that's is this normal uh what is this clear all none Every stage that is not a hell stage on hard. Okay. And then complete all hell stages. Okay, I guess it is normal then because they are giving three medals for, for three difficulties basically. That's cool. I like medals. Okay. <clears throat> so here's the altar. We have three elites. And again, let's just jump in and see what happens, because trying to figure out before the stage, it's, it's a wasted effort, honestly. Oh boy. Sarkaz Bloodwalker. Cannot be blocked? Oh nice, new Wraith. Collects up to 5 pieces of dropped Blood Umber. When defeated, drops all Blood Umber. It's a wraith, but it's also a car. Amazing. Mm. 
I wonder how much HP that thing has. Mm, I think I want Shirayuki here. Shirayuki would be great. But they have a bunch of band tiles. Oh well. Really, shouldn't that be worrying about that guy first? If he has too much HP, he's just gonna leak because I can't do anything. And my bubble is dying! God damn it. Uh, honestly, I like those guys. They're fun. Oh, and they are sending slugs at the bottom as well. That is not cool. Who mobs dwarfs damage? The slugs, yeah, I know. I just didn't think the that bubble would die so quickly. <laughs> Okay, <clears throat> tell me how much HP you have. You have more HP than I want. Okay, uh, let me think. Uh, I think there is one enemy that I didn't see that has a spawn yet. There's one more elite. It's probably defenders, right? There are sent defenders to the bottom. Let me see how much defense he has. I'll probably be using Stealth here again, and I guess I I say they want Shirayuk here. I can probably bring. Uh, yeah, I didn't see a lot of the enemies. Okay, yeah, your defense is very sad. I will bring May for you. I guess that that works. Way true as well. I could meme this guy and use like Shaw or something. If I want. Let's see. I mean. I still. And that's what. Item for CC? Oh yeah, I can use Ethan. I used the asbestos. Let's also find this chapter because arts damage all spawns instead charge for her skill. Uh, how does the asbestos work again? She gets SP when she dodges? I think that's it. <laughs> want some snipers here right now. Should I want to be dealing damage to, big, to the big guys? How much is Totter gonna deal? It's okay. Totter's not gonna do enough damage, I think, for me to care about bringing him against the guys. Sure, let's bring Ethan, why not? Ethan works. Yeah. Let me bring a couple healers. 3 SP when hit by arts. Okay, it's even better than that then. She gains SP when attacked by arts damage. <clears throat> uh, what else do I want? I probably want tarts anyways. For sure, I'm bringing Tagi. I gotta kill at least a couple of the guys early at the bottom, I think. Sijon is good. Also, Kuma, Totter doesn't do enough damage. The Seizure. <laughs> what? I'm a little bit confused. Are you making fun of me saying that Totter doesn't do enough damage? Or are, or are you telling me that Totter doesn't do enough damage? <laughs> oh no, oh yeah, no, I get it. It's for what I want him to do. If I wanted to deploy him against the runny guy, then he would be better. But I don't want to do that. Let's bring me. And what else do I want? I want more casters. I didn't even bring casters. What the fuck? 
Uh, where do I fit May here? Not May. Uh, click. Where do I fit click in here? I don't. We hope that this is enough. No, but I need... Wait, where are the respawn outers? It's just up top. The ones at the bottom won't die. We'll, we'll be fine. Okay. So I don't need to worry about the bottom, I think. Now, yeah, let's see. Gumu to help block in front of the blue box? No, I brought guard for that. Okay. Oh wait, I get it. This guy can, uh, the this lugs can respawn from this guy before he dies. That's kind of cool, honestly. Uh, deploy me, stealth, and medic. Okay, my finger will be fine because I have Marto with me. <clears throat> I guess those guys don't block the, the device, so I can't just use the device. Oh, I shouldn't have activated me right there. My mistake. Yeah, the attack slowly. <laughs> the device doesn't even care about them. <clears throat> uh, but the ending, I'll have to do something about it. Hmm. Wait, if I just bring another sniper, the device goes all the way, right? Okay. We're almost killing one of these guys. Um. Wait a second. Okay, one guy's coming from the bottom. Mm, I guess I can do this. Maybe this works. No, I won't have enough damage here. I made a mistake. He collects crystals, right? Yeah, he does. Well, good thing the device doesn't get bound. <laughs> Wait, they can't kill the devices? I don't remember that ever happening. Well... Yeah, it's stun guys coming. Uh, well, that that's Jover. I'm gonna die so hard to this guy, and I can't do anything about it. <laughs> I know, don't know, deploy Verdant on him or something. Yeah, I'm I'm like super dead. Um, <clears throat> another sniper in the here. Hi, sorry I haven't been in here much. I was in the hospital. Hi Mimi, welcome, welcome. What happened to you? Why did you go to the hospital? I thought you just had some... You, you were doing stuff in your house that you said... You were... were building the house or something. Good to see you, good to see you. Uh, don't kill my sniper, please. Yeah, please don't kill Tag. I need you, Tag. No! My hopes and dreams! No! God damn it. Only one guy. I hate myself. I'm so trash.
Let's do this better this time. Come on, opinion on this chapter difficulty. Harder than chapter 12 or easier? I can't say it yet, because I'm not in the hard stages yet. I am a slow player. I haven't finished that everything like you guys did. <laughs> uh, what does Crystal Collector do exactly? He just carries the crystals. Try to move crystals to respawn tower. Collect crystals and transport them to altar for respawn. Come on, guess who got a double hoarder today? You! And they were very happy for it. Basically even more Zergroot on top. Oh lol, I had like a surgery or something, I'm not even sure anymore. Oof. At least they're good right now. Uh, I guess our ring is the wrong choice here. I need a stronger guard. Mm. A stronger guard. Someone who can get past the defense of the guy. But Irene is doing fine, I guess. I don't really want Indigo, honestly. I think I just want another sniper. No, but the device will just die. Let me let me see my tiles. I have one tile there. I'll just put Indigo in that tile right there. It should be okay. Yes, we're stalling these legs for the end. <clears throat> Zergrush. <laughs> I know there's a lot of Russian people here in chat, but I can't read Russian, guys. <laughs> Let, let's not write in Silitic. Seventeen. <clears throat> this chapter is kind of fun to be honest. True damage is a godsend. Because of the crystals? I don't think the crystals are that big of a deal. But we'll see. I, I might still regret that. Hmm. Like the chapter overall, but the device are scanned on most stages. It's more work to push the device across the stage than simply kill every other enemy. Yep. But that that's just all what I always say. Arc Knights create mechanics for you to ignore. That's what they know how to do. No way. Yep, especially boss stage. You almost need to stall at second boss phase. Uh, let me think here. Mm. Wait, I should have brought another another medic instead of performer. Uh, I kind of want it done here. Okay. Kill those lugs. Now may get a couple stuns for me. I can't see his HP. Okay, he's dead. That works. In this one, we will just use Indigo on him. I said we're just gonna use Indigo on him, please! Get the binds! Okay. That guy is gonna be super scary though. I think the first one that's come is not to be is not gonna be super scary. Just because nothing really died around him up until now. 
But the next guy is gonna be a pain. Yeah, this guy has no buffs. Mm. Okay. What do I do now? Okay, he's, he's not that buffed. He's not dealing that much damage. I think I'll be fine. Let me see. I want to swap someone. For Perfumer. Um, Ethan. Your skill's out. Do not activate his skill. Okay, he died, but that's fine. The guy died as well. And that's good. Now we just need to... <clears throat> we just need to escort. One, two, three... One, two. Let's lie here. <sighs> Do the escort mission now. I need to redeploy some mobs. Now we wait. Because they banned those tiles. Okay. It's not even hard, it's just a waste of time. Yep. A lot of mechanics in Arc Knights are like that. You play too often to with Ursus Girls, that's why you're here now. <laughs> yeah, lots of time, Keku. Kill that Rave, he will simply walk past. By the way, no Pinecone. Yep, I didn't bring Pinecone this time. Extra difficult challenge? I didn't see a use for her. On this stage. Uh, oh god, that's a terrible pun. <laughs> Found this chapter to be much easier than I was expecting. Yeah, even my skill issue was able to beat the boss with only two. Bombs are mostly bonus, annoying waste of time more like, similar to trees in chapter 11. Where after you beat the stage, you need to do a bit of annoying busy work to clear. Yep. At first I tried without bomb, I haven't read his skill. If it made the chapter a cakewalk. The moment I read the bombs make him take more damage, he died 2 seconds after being hit by one. That's interesting. Okay, we are at the stage I want to clear, and we still have 1 hour and 40 minutes. So, it, so I can get stuck for a little bit. Not for too much. <laughs> mm. Chapter 11 Hell Stage, I just used Scud to stall Sting Knight. My advice, deal with alters as fast as you can, simply most of the stage, do not ignore chapter mechanics. Chapter mechanics in Dark Knights are made to be ignored. Most, most mechanics that they introduce just do nothing or just harm you for interacting with them. Exact opposite advice, ignore alters. It's not worth the bother. Anyway, you and top up are very strong here. Pinecone, two are no exception. Guys, I've been playing with Pinecone in basically every stage so far. But this stage I didn't see a use for her. Don't worry about it. <laughs> ah, three lane map. How I hate work nights. Okay, we have three alters. Mm. I can only imagine that those four tiles at the bottom left are banned. Which is annoying. Yep. And most of stages I just use my scouter to kill Umbers with fast three through damage. Hypergriff is pretty inconsistent with how they make mechanics. Leo, map lied. It's not banned. That's good then. There's four altars. Uh, that must be the condition. Yeah. Additional altar. I'm not gonna try to figure it out. Let's just jump in and see. <clears throat> oh, this stage. Bottom tiles are insane. Stage mechanics often screw you up though. Like that boulder and fragile flower thing a couple of events ago. I hate that. Yeah, those tiles are banned. We only have melee tiles there. We have a bunch of defenders, which I'm just gonna ignore. Let them come. I'll bring the casters. Mm, I can use pinecone here. Yeah. 
Apparently we will have slugs in all lanes, so I can have like pinecone here. And then I can block around her. I want to see what's gonna spawn at the bottom. I'm curious. Also, let's see if it's any worth healing the defenders or if they just going to, to, to start spawning everywhere. I bet they're just gonna start spawning everywhere. Casters at the bottom, oh, come on, go fuck yourself, Arcanites. You know that you did this on purpose. You make a lane with no range of tiles, just close by. And then you make the infinite casters around it. You know you did this on purpose. This is just annoying. Go die, Arknights. Go die. Anyway, what else do we have here? Oh yeah, these guys are here to kill the cast the, the medics. I get it. Mm, Utag is not able to solo then. They're red. Yeah, whatever. I just don't know if a lot of casters will spawn the bottom or if it's just gonna be three of them. No, it's a lot. Okay. Yeah. Arknight just decided to pull the. Yeah, I don't care about your phone anymore. Looking through my stream, I spent 45 minutes on this stage, lol. Sure. I haven't done this adverse yet. How low have you tried to go, Silverga? I am playing full squad. I'm not trying to do anything fancy. I don't have Mudrock built on my... Or, or my Hosa yet. About 30 minutes, I guess. Honestly, it takes out to realize the chapter, spend bugs. Totter for bottom lane? No. I'm just gonna point a medic at the bottom, and other than that, I'll just use melee. How long have I tried to do what? How low have you gone on op count? Since you said we spent 45 minutes on the stage. Also, Alter the Strange required on this stage, in my opinion. <laughs> You're the same guy who say that interacting with the chapter mechanic is a good thing. I don't know if I believe in you, sir. <laughs> um, so, what I want to do for this one. I do want to bring Pinecone, because I think it's a good idea for this stage. There's two lanes that she can kill. That was my live stream clear. we all. Don't you do low up on stream? I remember seeing you do low up before on stream. Spent today at Team Lutonada's video and then tried to cuff up some of my lungs out for the rest of the day. <laughs> Try to not die too hard. You die when you're dead. Okay, so we're gonna just bring Gumu and someone like... I guess I could just use Estelle at the bottom. Mm, so let me bring another guard. Someone like Humus might be fine. And then for the rest, I do need another medic. I'm not happy with this stage. Because now I only have two casters. Uh, I want to change anything? I probably don't even have the apply limit for all those people. And I want my Utagi. Eh, I don't feel like thinking. People are telling me this stage is gonna be hard. I'm not gonna think about it. Just bring out the 13 up. There you go. It was a blind clear stream for the most part. I sometimes do low up too. Wait. 
Didn't you play this chapter on CN? <clears throat> Are you talking about a CN stream? I'm confused, Suburga. I destroyed the altar just because why not? It was Mountain Glad on the bottom lane, while being healed by Pure Stream Science. The last two altars, absolute uh, hemorrhoid in the ass. <laughs> Sounds painful. So here's the deal. I want to use Humus here. I think I can block in the far, far left. Damn, I'm dead. <laughs> but I like to walk around while taking stages. Or thinking stages. I destroyed three of them. Did I want to use Super Gun Strat for the casters? <sighs> Let's see. Let's deploy here. If more than six caster spawns, then I'm gonna have to change my strat. But for now, I think I'll be fine if I just try to hold them. And deploy a medic. I don't know if it's a good idea to have pure string healing, healing arena as well, but for now, just leave it. By the way, Kuma, my ops are not maxed out. So that might have a huge advantage for sure. <coughs> okay, deal some damage to this guy for me, you target. Not to this lug. Why are you killing this lug? Okay. Uh, I think she can take one more hit. No, she couldn't. Darn it! I just killed myself. Yeah, I'll just ignore the defenders. Not worth my time. Let them walk. Okay. Okay, she's good, she's good. Just use the skill for safety. Okay, the first big guy is down. <laughs> Only all the others should go. The tag bad girl. <laughs> tag dying a lot lately. Need correcting. <laughs> what you guys talking about? Mm. With, without outer, destroying casters on bottom basically immortal. Yeah, that's okay. We can kill the outers at the end. After the defenders walk and die. I just want to see if too many casters will spawn. Because if more than 6 of them spawn, then we have a problem. But if it's only 6, I think we're okay. Actually... Perfumer isn't really doing anything right there. Let me, let me change. Okay. I'm too late to full clear chapter on CN. Just unlocked normal farm stages and dipped. <laughs> okay. I would I expected you to have final chapter releases, honestly. I struggle in chapter releases, but I like them. Uh, that's exactly six. Let's see if I am dying or not. Mm. I would rather Utagi not die right there, so... Mm, but now Irene is going to die. Yeah. I need more firepower. Pinecone is not doing anything. How many enemies is this? 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17? Uh, 17 plus 6? Yeah, those are all the enemies in this stage. <clears throat> uh, 
Humu shit. Works fine on every stage. Shit balls don't do enough damage to him. Many counters ahead of Cien on star stages. Uh, let me see. There are like 7 to 8 casters on the bottom. Good to meet you. I only counted 6. Maybe I'm wrong, but I only counted 6. Is there any 4 star that can deal with true damage? Cliff Hearts a 5 star? Nope. We have no true damage in 4 stars. I don't mind that though. True damage should be something special for special characters. For example, I wouldn't mind if Ascalon got true damage, but she didn't. But Weedy already has true damage, so that it doesn't even work. My opinion is irrelevant to Hypergriff. <laughs> so I'm changing Pinecone. I don't want Pinecone here. Mm, and the arena is not doing well. I'm just gonna change arena to a defender, I feel like. Uh, yeah. I'm gonna deploy Indigo where, where Pinecone was. And. What was I gonna change? I was gonna change Pinecone out for something. Do I have another Heli Drops? Most counts. <clears throat> Let me just check something. Okay, I can kill one of the defenders early. Oh no! I forgot the Myrtle. We the Nightmare and Winner Holder. Yep, I know that we have a bunch of them. That's just how I feel. I might have the wrong number of casters in mind. That's okay. Me too. Mm. True damage, summoner closure. If closure is an operator, she has to be Jay's class. Anything other than Jay's class, it's a mistake for closure. <laughs> and she has to spend your your LMD instead of DP. <laughs> The only opinion Hypergriff cares about is CN server. I don't know, my, my talk went way ahead of that. It's like, Hypergriff doesn't care about my opinion because they already did things that are different from what I think. Okay, <laughs> so here's what I want to do. Kill one of these early. Humus will deal with these legs for us. Then I can use attack early here as well. Since we are heli dropping, we might as well heli drop as early as we can. That way we don't lose as much time later with our heli drops. <clears throat> Here. Then tip. Oh wait, 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 wait! Ah, don't let that slug go go through. It's okay. It's okay. We're good. Oh. Moose is killing some of those crystals for us. That doesn't matter though. You can stop. Okay. Mm, I think I want Bubble as far right as possible. That way I will have no issues with the big guys, I think. Wait! Why is he so buffed? What happened? Nobody died around here. This game is a this game is a lie. Uh, closure, new specialist robber. <laughs> Are there four star debuffers? Yes, there's Meteor and Haze. Mm. 
Well, I guess I'll just deal with that guy. Let me kill some more defenders. Wait, now I have absolutely no AoE whatsoever. That's okay though. Let me pay the cost of the device right now. <laughs> I don't really need to, but let me do that. <clears throat> oh yeah, there's Moose as well. Of them 5 stars, isn't it? No, we have some 4 star debuffers. Like Pramanix. Yeah, that class we don't have. You counting Bubble, I guess? Yeah, Bubble also is a debuffer. Mm. Okay. Wait for the guy to attack. We're good, we're good. I didn't need that, but that, that works. Okay, what else? Now oh, there's one slug getting in the way of moose. Where's my yard's damage? Hmm. Not gonna activate bubble yet. Save the skill. Save the skill for the last moment. Okay. Uh, here come the last defender. I can kill him probably. And if I counted the enemies wrong, this should be the end of the stage. I could be wrong though. Like, let me even deploy another medic here. Oh, there's another guy. Mmm, that's bad. What? I'm leaking! What do I do? I mean, of course I'm leaking. Bubble has a bunch of big guys on her. <clears throat> yeah. I took a little bit too long to kill the enemies. Oh, stop! That didn't happen. Yeah, now I'm dead. I need more damage. Instead of click and... Instead of click and... Other one. I need to do something about those two guys. <clears throat> That's definitely what I was thinking about. <laughs> There's no 4 star center around pure debuffing yet. That's fine. Honestly, most times when I see someone bringing a Hexer, they don't really need the Hexer. They are dealing enough damage anyway, so I'm like, why did you struggle before and you're not struggling now when the, your operator definitely had enough damage? Not saying that the situations don't exist. But I'm saying that when I see people, that's how I feel about Hexers. <laughs> Are you on PC though? I am on PC. <clears throat> what do I do then? I guess the problem is that Click and Indigo are not dealing AoE. So if I do this, I should be fine, right? Pinecon won't do because I'm deploying my medic on the good Pinecon tile. Mm. The time I see people use Hexers is for a boss with high defense to be melted by Exo. Why are you using Exo on a high defense boss? <laughs> anyway, let's go. The SP down, those defenders are gonna be so annoying to deal with in each stages. Maybe. I don't think so. I think those are good defenders in general. I think they have a good gimmick to them. Except that half of what they do is make you ignore the mechanic even harder. 
But other than that, I don't mind those guys. I think they are kind of cool. Okay, let's go. I'm going to do the same here. Amaya is uber strong. I know she's strong. Doesn't mean she's useful when people play with her. <laughs> and I'm not talking about every situation and every player. I'm talking about the people I see. That might be a different subset of people you guys are using to. Who knows? Oh yeah, I... I want to deal with this guy a little bit. Let's go Tagi. Good job. Let me see something. Yeah, you don't reach. Mm. I do want to deploy bubble here. I mean, if you want to be us, well, if you want to be optimal, we we'll just end up using three ops for the entire game. <laughs> Harsh reality. I don't get why this guy is healing. It's like, it's like he gets buffs when the these legs respawn for some reason. Just give me a sec, guys. I'm trying to focus on the stages because. As I said before, chapter releases I struggle with, so I don't want to give too much, too much room for chance. Mm, let me kill a couple of these. <clears throat> to be honest, Shamari was useful for chapter 11 in boss instead of having to cycle bodies. Chapter 11 boss... Oh yeah, that guy. That's true. She has her skill every every cycle almost, right? All hexers are pretty strong. Man, I'm messing up my message real bad today. I may be losing my literacy. <laughs> Last time I saw Exo debuffer meta was in 2021 or something. Nah, she still works. Ah, cool, man. The reason why I do get buffed is because the outer sucks the spawn when it's respawning. Yeah. That's what I was betting on. Kinda of annoying though. Why does it count for buffing him when they respawn? Does it say on his lines that when enemies respawn he gets buffed as well? I guess I didn't notice. Try to kill the, the guy. No, he's just healing now because I just killed a crystal. Or did they kill a crystal? I probably didn't kill a crystal, but. Yeah, I don't know where's my damage. Maybe if I'm lucky I can kill one of them? And then if I can kill one of them, maybe I'm good? I can't kill one of them. The defender is here. And there's a third one coming now. I need more damage. One thing I can do to bring more damage is maybe bring... <clears throat> maybe I can bring Arena instead of Humus and point Arena down. Maybe I can bring like Durna instead of, instead of Bubble. This is so close though. I think Humus isn't doing anything. Oh, one of the guys is going super hard on Bubble right now. <sighs> Uh, 
This is so sad. Because I'm so close, but so far. Like, look at this. Musa almost killed. Oh, almost killed him. Okay, there's one guy left. If this guy dies, I think Utag is attacking an altar. No, okay. <sighs> Time to walk the path. <clears throat> the tag just killed the slug. The other responded. <laughs> the red spawn things die, heal the sword, dude. It could be that the game code works kind of like this. Crystal in outer range, increase slug spawn count, kill the crystal, then spawn the same number of slug as count. Oh, that's true. The, the slugs probably die when they respawn. You're right. That makes sense. Man, those casters here, they are kind of shifting around. I'm kind of scared. I feel like if I don't go fast enough, those things are just gonna... Mess me up. It's a little bit too late to think like that, but... Let's see. Mm. Oh! Pff. I didn't need to send the whole path. Okay, there's two to go. Let me do this. <clears throat> I think it's the same situation as Gnosis is. Like, he's really useful, but not necessary in most situations. Maybe I shouldn't have said it like that. My mistake. No operator is really needed ever. Okay, Kama. Kama! The tag will do the last few ones for me. Okay, it didn't take too long. It took like 25 minutes or something like that. We're good! Hmm. That's exactly how it works, and crystals use for intense purpose and enemy unit. Annoying. Guy is going hard on bubble, that sounds like an innuend. <laughs> it's you who said it. With how many progress make four stars now, it's very likely that a four star hexer would be bad. I'm still sad that Lutonada doesn't have anything special, she's just a defender who can't be healed. Bro, if it's not six stars, it's made by chat GPT. <laughs> Scanned by stage mechanics, made by chat GPT Lumala. Correct me if I'm wrong, but Supporter is likely the weakest class among 4 stars only. Uh, unless you're talking about Deep Color, yes. <laughs> in IS, definitely. They don't do anything in IS. Depends on what you mean by weakest. On release of Arcanites, every new player received a free 5 star from 4 options, I guess. And I picked Pramanix. We still have that for for new players now. They added it at some point. Everybody who didn't play in on release got the the four operator starter pack. Mm, don't you have some connections with Gal because names that sound like Asterix and Obelix? Dude, Asterix and Obelix, not that I remember of that. Asterix and Obelix was the first reason I ever went for a I ever gone to a library to borrow books because a local library here had Asterix and Obelix. <laughs> so I just went to the library to read comics, not to read books. <laughs> it was amazing. 20 years ago or something like that. No, probably not 20, but that, that long. In the early 2000s. Not really, I think Podem Kids is strong for Hestru because silence. 
most of the time, you want to just ignore silence, just like you want to ignore elemental damage, in my opinion. Quite handling AoE, so crowd control it is. And if you want crowd control and AoE, you just use Pinecon. <laughs> I think I have time to play a little bit more, so I'll keep going. But then Robert are good in AS. The color is just dog there. Yep, the color is just weaker than 5 star summoner, I forgot her name. She is still strong as a summoner. It's just that in AS, her summons just die. Which is sad. Okay, let's see. This stage has three elites, <clears throat> more enemy move speed. We have... Okay, no. <sighs> I'm, I'm not even gonna complain, I complain about this too much. Let me think. It's a one lane map with bad ranged tiles. We're probably gonna have ranged enemies here. We have it bent tiles to make the ending annoying for the altar. <laughs> Again, let's just jump in and see what happens. No reason to to think too hard about it. Weakest is in how they perform, but again, correct me if I'm wrong. In general, yes, I would say so. Supporter is the worst class. In Vanguards we have Vigna at least. How they perform is too vague. <laughs> Silver Gun has the... Has to be on the defensive because the color can solo a lot of stages and it's like... Yeah, the color is busted. Until she isn't. I was gonna not complain until I saw that this is a Wraith lane. Why the fuck would they put a red box that you can't interact with in any way with a path in just to your blue box? What is the point? Why? And now I know, it's just to be annoying. Okay, the Wraith goes around. At least. God fucking damn it, Arcanite. You make it so hard for me to not hate you sometimes. I don't know. 29 enemies. Uh, yeah, that, that guy is leaking for sure. Let's see if I can survive until I see all the elites. He's co he's collecting the plague. <laughs> he does look like a plague doctor, right? Because of the the phallic nose and the round eyes. Let's see. There's another elite to spawn. I want to see what it is. Uh, I guess do this as well. I kinda can't lick this guy if I want to set the last elite. No! I didn't see the last elite. It's insane how silence is more dead than levitate. The color is the most used by 4 star, by far, but she's pretty relevant if you're doing low op shit. If you're not doing low op shit. If you're just throwing random ops, there's just less of them. But obviously, they're the weakest. Damn, Estelle is better than I expected. <laughs> she's a guard, of course Estelle is good. <laughs> no comments on that, okay? Thank you. Okay. What else could they spawn to make things annoying? Casters? The casters are not elites, right? The casters are just small enemies. Honestly, Lapland fell off. Better science options exist now. 
my tap options. Waifu. <laughs> Problem is that most of the newer builds can be silenced now. I don't see how anyone pushes Lapland from her silence niche. It looks like Plague Doctor or enemy from the Evil Within 2. Mm, let me think. I do want casters because I saw a bunch of defenders, even if I don't know what the last elites are. But since the Plague Doctors are not gunning from the exit, I don't need to worry too much about blocking the exit, I just need more damage on the exit. So let's do that. I'm not even gonna bring two vanguards for this map. Uh, I think I have a Pine Cone Tile here. I do. I want to bring a Pine Cone for this one. The guys don't have that much defense, nor HP. Let's bring Totter, and then let's bring a bunch of arts. Like Click, Gray, Indigo Pudding. Uh, let's bring just Perfumer and Pure String just in case. I do want Item, Item will be nice. And then I think I want like Arena for the back. Let's bring the, the funny man. <clears throat> Waifu, sorry. Waifu furry, so not a good option in any case. <laughs> you say that, but every operator in Dark Knights look like an animal. <laughs> I get where you're coming from, but it's like... I don't think there's a reason to fight this battle. It's okay if you're not a furry. I'm not either. But like... I don't think there's a reason to hate on the furries in Arknights. She's literally waifu. <laughs> okay. I want Pinecone here. Let me see if I can kill this guy early. Since I got Pinecone deployed. Go over there. Help me out. There you go. Anima Weirs didn't make you for it. That's true. That's what I'm saying. Hmm. I do want him to go more on the left a little bit. Yeah, that guy's not dying. Okay. Uh, yeah, that's about it. Let's just retreat to you. I guess I'll deploy Gray here. Okay, let's see what happens. Oh wait! These lugs here are outside the outer range? That's nice! <clears throat> Hell, Texas Alter can science. As if she needs it in the first place. <laughs> It's funny, really. I guess it's just so Texas can, like, kill a bunch of slugs without dying, I guess? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Go, Ethan! I love Ethan. Hmm, there's a bunch of defenders right there. I'm gonna have issues with those. There, there's too many. Pretty fine. Here they come. Kuma, wait until he discovers Mount and his usefulness. What do you mean by that? Oh, you mean... <laughs> I got it. We'll wait. We'll wait and see what he thinks about the furries then. <laughs> Yeah. People mistake me for a furry all the time because of me using a bear picture. 
Hey, come on, guys, it's just a bear. Have you guys never seen bears? In nature? They're like super cool. They're not cool when they try to invade your home if you live in Canada or something. But if you just see them in the forest, they're the coolest thing ever. Oh, I will use Ethan here. I was thinking, I was considering just saving Ethan, but uh, I think I'm better off just using this skill to kill whatever I can. Okay, stun guys. Stun guys are here as well. That's the third elite. I think I'll be fine against the stun guys. Time for you to shine, Gray. Kill yourself, Verdant. There you go, and those are the last two enemies. Wait, I won't even have to kill the altars at all. <laughs> this is so funny. Hmm, Ethan is coming back, thankfully. Now just wait for the last guy. And no, it's okay if we die if he dies outside rain. Yep, that's it. Not even worth activating the altars. Hmm. Wife is the only one I've seen who's got any sort of negativity for being a furry. None of the male furries get the treatment. <laughs> I guess man like man. <laughs> that would be my my bet. I've used Texas S1 only once during S. I don't see when you need it her. I don't see when you will need it her to silence. What if all the cinematic? <laughs> I will have to read the story at some point. Ooh, Iron. I need Iron. Ike is the ugliest Arcan Ike's character. Change my mind. <laughs> the poor guy. He's drawn so well. There's a lot of worse art than Axe art. For example, Old Franca Zero art. Or Broca and his salsa charms. <laughs> or Broca and his skin and his very small head. <laughs> Ike hung incident. Ike hung in the incident. Ike's no ugly. How dare you? Ike's just a goofy guy. The mountain hung seems drown out the haters. Also, like just legit in general. What is outside? <laughs> Another furry op isn't better. Corsero also has cases where his science is more useful than Lapland. Because of the AoE? I guess. What do we have here? Two elites. Let's see. I have time to keep going. <clears throat> Worst one is a tie between Silver Ash E2 and that Firewatch skin. <laughs> you mean the Firewatch with the salsa, the salsa fingers? <laughs> yeah, I guess that's a funny one. Silver Ash, Silver Ash E2. I don't remember how Silver Ash E2 art looks like. Let me check this real quick, because that that sounds interesting. Silver Ash, Ichu. I don't see anything wrong with it. What is wrong with his Ichu art? And while I was looking, I am leaking here. I just want to see what the elites are. Uh, just a sec. Mm, I don't like Nightmare 2 art because it's better than anything in there. <laughs> it's true, it looks like an easier art, doesn't it? I think it's mostly because it doesn't have a big background around her. That it looks like that. Mm, defenders are coming in already. Don't be like that. More band tiles. Go to shit. 
Mm. Yeah, this is the wrong medic style. The right medic style is here, so we can deploy more arts. Quite a lot of defenders, though. And they walk all at once. Okay, I need gray here. I don't need you, Puri. I need gray. Ooh, mini boss. Wait, they shouldn't be excited about that. Mini bosses are annoying. Life Bones Commander, capable of giving Blood Calling Outers the ability to produce Blood Umber when defeated. We return the Blood Calling Outer and revive it for a period of time. Okay, so this is an infinite mini boss. I don't know what are Blood Umbers. I'm confused. I'll have to read the, the skill later. What are you doing? Why are you, why are you chanting like that? What is going on? Uh, I don't know. Deploy Verdant. That Tiles is occupied already. And that Tiles is banned. Oh no. Here, here we go. I don't know why she was chanting. But if she was chanting, that's not good. And that's a lot of slugs. The game is gonna crash. No, don't do me like that. Of course you're ranged. Why would I why would you not be ranged? What I was thinking. Yeah, that's way too many slugs. Look at the game lagging. And that's the last two enemies, so we can bring the... We can start making the outer go. Yeah, she's just gonna kill Indigo, but if the defender dies, that's okay. Okay. 20 FPS gaming! It really is, though. Let's see. I mean this one, but there's another cool one. This one's really cool though. I'm confused. I can't tend Suzuran's voice. The most of them only focus on Suzuran because she's the only six star small girl. And she killed my pinecone, so I am probably dead. She were right on my Kuma to my Arknight's loud incorrect buzzer. <laughs> she were right on my Kuma until I Arknight! <laughs> That's more like it. Mm. How's your HP, Ethan? You're fine. Yeah, hold her in there, Indu. Okay, that one is done. You know, people were saying that this chapter is easier and stuff. Maybe I'll have to agree just because we've come this far and I haven't been stuck for too long yet. That's unusual. This altar will take forever to get to, get to the end though. <laughs> hmm. What could I possibly do? Maybe... Verdant outside the lane? She's, they're just gonna explode the altar. I don't know what to do here. <laughs> like, what the fuck? We're gonna take forever for this stage. I have a right to hate her. Uh, to hate, I guess. Refine con. Origin C. And he's been as doll. Yeah, Zan is a living doll. I sent two links if you can't see it because YouTube screened. 
Uh, no, I have I have links banned on this channel because there's too many bots. So you won't be able to send links here. YouTube will just delete every any link you send. If you want me to see something, you can tell me where it is and what it is about. Then I can go look for it. I'm sorry, but that is the best way I can do things. Okay. The, 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 the woman died, but she's gonna respawn. At least... I think with Pinecon here, we can make the thing move. We're just gonna have to hope that the girl won't just kill the altar. This is not the best style, but no, I shouldn't do that. Come on, stop! Stop attacking the altar! Ah, walk! It's not gonna get there. You get the SPD, right? Come on, come on! Come on! Yes! 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 No! All these legs! God damn it! Get, get the altar in! It's getting there! It's getting there! Verdant did it! <laughs> Look! We can hate Verdant as much as we want, okay? But he did something for us! He was useful one time. Could have been anyone else. But he did it. Pink hair boss works here as love. Have some mods on, I suppose? What? Are you telling me you want to be my mod, Ruby? <laughs> I am bot, by the way. Works here as love. That's evil, Super Gun. Uh, Teresis? I just can't over the fact that Ethan is just playing bondage bondage. Saw it, yeah, I see what you mean by that. These fan-made ones are loads better than the official E2. What did he mean by this? Insane response. The racing cubes operator version coming in 2026. Super gun, it is, it still is, but the hairs isn't very skimpy like many other Sukubus designs are. Let's go. Hey, I miss him some context right there. I'm sorry guys. I, I have to focus to clear the stages. Verdant MVP! Verdant carry! Destroy the altars! <laughs> I find Sukubai from a design standpoint to be very boring and stale. Aren't Sukubai just hot guys? Just like Sukubus are hot women? I think your concept of skimpy. Has been competed by Azure Lane. Insane verdant value. Oh, we're talking about the fun made it art of Nightmare. Oh, I haven't seen it. Oh, so that's the links that you guys sent. Yeah, sorry about that. Right now I can't do anything about it. What you could do, if you want me to look at it, is send the link without it being a link. Then YouTube shouldn't be able to, to ban it. Like with some spaces in between or something. I'm not gonna be here all stream, but in general it might be a good idea to have mods if you really are having a bot problem. YouTube in general has a bot problem. I banned links because of comment section. It was like an, a year ago <laughs> that I did that. The Sukubus boss. Sukubai is just plural. The mouth. Uh, what is the word for Sukubus man then? Because I, I know that there is a difference. And yeah, you're right. My mind just went places. Those are homunculi. What? No! <laughs> homunculi is a completely different thing, Ruby. Incubus for male, but it's not exactly a male equivalent. Oh yeah, Incubus. I thought that was the case. I thought Sukubus... I thought Sukubai were just hot woman, and Incubai were just hot man. 
but demons. Uh, 18. Let's see. I I only needed the the stage 15 to, to finish raising Verdant. But I will give this one a try. This one looks like it's going to be a pain. It's completely opposite uh, two lane map. And we don't have good ranged tiles in either of them. This is going to be a pain. I guess we have a shawl tile. Wait. You can't even use that shawl tile. The enemies have no reason to be there. Let's have a look at what this stage has for us. Actually, no, it's a, it's fine. I can use one of those 10 pot. Ten pot. Let's just see. Oh, the comment section makes perfect sense then. Yep. I really come to any people's stream because bu busy right now. Just lucky got time. Well, thank you for coming to this stream then. God fucking damn it! First thing I see is a wave of five freaking you know, Im immortal casters. What do you want me to think about this? I think I'm complaining way too much for someone who's not struggling that hard in the chapter. But I still hate it. And we'll see the boss as well. Yeah, uh, I don't want to leak. I want to see the other elites. <laughs> Can we do this? Can we get away with just activating the the thing? Oh wait, that's the wrong pinecone direction. I just realized. It's fine, it's fine. Yeah, and here we have bent tiles and stuff. The casters will just explode this, won't they? Won't they? I mean, they will probably just explode gray when I deploy gray right here. No! Okay, the bottom altar was easy. That's... okay? The mini boss is here again, yeah. They suddenly, suddenly changed things. <sighs> I don't like this girl. She's annoying. She deals too much damage to the device. Oh yeah, I forgot about the top left box. Well, darn it. Wait a second. Doesn't that mean that these guys won't respawn? Oh no, they don't need to be in range of the altar. That's true. No, that's, uh, that's true. That's true. Forget it. Or do they? Wait, le let me check some some stages a little bit back because I don't remember how those guys work. Thanks God, there is not so many gacha games with put that put a fortin to adding incubus. <laughs> let me see. This is the stage that had the casters. Oh yeah, no, I guess they won't respawn if they are not in outer range. That's good. So I can kill the casters early, I think. Let me just try this out. I don't think I'm gonna spend too much time on here. Ah, maybe we can clear this stage. Let's see, let's see. Uh, instead of pure stream though, since we have that annoying boss, I'm gonna bring Gavio. I guess I do need a second, a second good one. I just leave Perfumer in there, whatever. Not trying too hard. <clears throat> Azur Lane is an exemplary of horny designs and the concept as a whole. <laughs> what? It's not a good thing when oversexualized characters are throwing in your face characters of both genders. It is a it is annoying. That is true. But what do you but what do you think about Arcanites in general? Do you think Arcanites goes a little bit over t over the top? Or do you think Arcanites is just fine as it is? Because honestly, although Arcanites doesn't do the usual horny stuff, it is still quite horny. In different ways. 
Really? You can't attack that thing? You're kidding me, right? Let's see if I can kill the casters. Mm. Let me see, let me see. Ignites is definitely a tier game for me, even though there's sometimes a bunch a burnout time. They did not give Myrtle and Susibaka summer skins. <laughs> Let's see. No, he just responds. Oh yeah, that altar is is an altar. I I didn't realize because I killed it. That might work, but I would need to block this guy like right now. Yeah, because if I drop a defender like here and I somehow can keep it alive, then I can kill the casters without them respawning. It is a tough ask though, I think. To ask for a defender to stay there alive for a while. I can try. I can try. Let me try for real this time. The Parade skins is 100% better anyways. I don't like either, honestly. I think both skins for Myrtle are just like... Eh, don't like it. But I don't like Myrtle in general, so there's a bias right there. <clears throat> Because I find it fun in the strategy gameplay that felt unusual compared to other RTS or strat games. Yup, that's Dark Knights. If Dark Knights was a gacha game, as your usual gacha games, I wouldn't be playing Dark Knights because it would I would be tired of it like in the first month. But it has nice gameplay, and I like that. I want to bring two vanguards to speed things up. I still want my pinecone. Where are you? My Pinecone and my Estelle. I think I will need a Medic. It would be ideal if I just didn't need it though. Uh, we need Ethan because Estelle can't can't start the thing. I'll bring it on S1. Mm, Summer Skin doesn't even look like Myrtle to me. I'm still waiting for Speedo to rash. <laughs> Do you have time to continue playing today? I have a little bit. I can go like one or two more times. Summer skins are neat when they are not like bad. Kuma, Ichigo. Not liking Myrtle as a whole. <laughs> I still play with her, so like, you could call me a hypocrite. Okay. I do want a couple defenders. Uh, and I want Totter as well. Let me pick Totter before I forget. And I need Click to finish the path of the first device. Okay. So for defenders, I think I want Gumu and Matterhorn. Matterhorn has the highest chance to survive, I think. Do I want something else here? What do I want? Hmm... I don't know, Utag? That's it. They didn't need to give any up summer skins, but they fun service sales. I don't I don't hate summer skins in general. I like some fun service. Of course I do. But I don't buy that many skins just for the horny. I bought, uh, I think I bought only three skins for Horn alone, which were Hide skin, uh, Read skin, the normal Read, not Read Alter. I don't think I'm gonna buy Read Alter skin. And what was the last one? I remember there was a last one. I don't remember which one though. I would have to check. But in general, I buy the skins only if I like the character. Okay, let's start this. We need to get this device rolling as fast as possible. Wait, 
I forgot someone to deal a couple hits to the device here. I guess o Tag will do it. And then I'll do this. Oh no, that's the Totter tile. Oh no, that's fine, that's fine. No, it's not fine. Uh, now I'm in trouble. I'll be fine. Okay. This is not great, but I think I have a chance of killing these casters outside outer range. Let's see. Oh, but this guy is gonna bring the casters anyway, so this was wasted effort. Or not. I'm confused. I just know that the defender is just gunning for the exit. Oh, and we have this guy here. Let's see. Did the casters die? Or is this guy carrying the casters? I think the casters died. This is not gonna work though, because the mini boss is just gonna kill my defenders. I'm kinda lost on what to do here. I guess I have to deploy my caster? <laughs> I don't know! How do I proceed? It's like my whole mission was completed. Okay, the boss killed my vanguard, now my, the boss is gonna kill my caster. Yeah, this is the end. And I need Ethan S2 here. Okay, the boss is going straight left. That sucks. I don't like that the boss is going straight left. Kuma, have you ever felt like your main existence is just Bible? I am the last person in the world who would say an operator in this game is not just Fable. Maybe, maybe you haven't heard me complain enough, or not complain, but just yap enough about it. But I will never, I will never say an operator is useless. Doesn't matter how much you try. Verdant's Bizarre Adventure. I think God's name is Reed Skin Horny. Has good legs! Here is, here. Look at it. Where, where is Reed? Reed is leveled up. Look! It's good legs! Look at it! It's horny! <laughs> mm. Characters with summer skins are perfect for cleaning summer film events. Love this kind of roleplay. I feel skin has nothing to do with it. Cleared most of those all day just with summer theme. Summer skins in break the ice though. Designer is subjective at the end of the day, and people can like harness stuff without being coomers. A lot of people simply like sexy content, right? It's tame or over the top. Uh it's far dirty for me right now. I don't think I'm gonna keep playing, guys. I'm gonna think about that stage offline and I'm gonna come back tomorrow. But let me see if I can find the third skin that I bought just for the horny. Mm, let's see. Skins, skins, skins that I bought just for the horny. Uh, it's probably someone I didn't raise because the four stars don't have any. That I know for sure. I mean, I guess Indigo counts, but I like Indigo so. I love Indigo's legs. Mm. Where are my... Let's see... Near the six stars, anyone here? It's probably six star, right? 
It's not Chen. I don't think it's Chen. Although Chen's skin is very horny. Look at those good legs right there. Oh, not this one. This one. Look at those nice legs. I guess you could count that. That would make it four then. Where is the other one? I remember there is another one. Oh yeah, Akafui. Akafui was the, the third one that I was thinking about. Look at it. Good. And the other one I said was Heidi. Where are you, Heidi? Heidi. Also not raised. Look at it. But yeah. Nice saying, Kuma. <laughs> Good luck on stage 6. I mean, they're nice, but Skadio's right there, you know? Cats. If only saw my vision and understood Nyan was hot. <laughs> She's literally hot, just not hot hot, you know? The cat in the side hot as fuck, yeah. Think harder. My brother! I got full skin and dryer. We got like five years younger after the altar. Have you ever... Yes, because read the altar is her past. It, it, it's literally the purpose of this the, the altar. <laughs> Have you ever felt like you needed Vermeer in any stage? Needed? I feel like I don't need anything ever. <laughs> no, I'm lying. Sometimes I feel like I have to play with the 4 star meta. But no, there's a lot of operators who are not needed. And that goes for 6 stars as well. Hmm, the gutter belts do look out of place. I think I progress should put gutter belts on Cuniplot. Real intellectual conversation going on right now. Damn, I never imagined Kuma to be a fit man. I'm not. I'm a leg man. Spudia have the best legs. Eh, don't like Spudia in general. Kafuyu fan, good taste. Hide skin. Mmm, yes. I'm seeing a trend, lol. <laughs> yes, yes, there is, there is a trend. But yeah, we, we did a lot more stages than I thought we would. We beat everything from 12. We start on 12, right? Yeah. We beat 12 all the way to 17. I was expecting to go only to 15. But that was nice. Tomorrow we can get to the boss stage. And hopefully kill the boss. Who knows? Tomorrow I'll have more time. It's just that today I have some stuff to do. And I... And I woke up way too late. So I started streaming late. But that will be it for today. Thick ties save lives. Yep. <laughs> But yeah, I'll have to leave you guys to it, guys. Sorry to cut the, the leg talk a little bit short. But thanks everyone for watching. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye.